Hello Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I hope you are all having a fantastic day so far. I'm going to be taking a look, seeing what's manifesting for you at this moment. What is going on right now in your current situation with you, the person that is on your mind, if any. And what spirit wants you to know and be aware of. All right, Capricorn. So for those of you interested in personal readings, I will leave all of that info in the description box below for you all. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all social media, TikTok, Instagram. I am Spiritually Goldie on all platforms. So, Capricorn. I'm hearing Libra. Libra. The letter M, J, Jacob. Balloons. I'm seeing a bunch of balloons, different color balloons. Um, a party, a birthday party. Someone attending a gathering or a celebration. Um, someone didn't show up. Okay. So Capricorn, you've been working really hard on creating stability for yourself financially. And I'm seeing congratulations. You, What you created, what you worked on is... It brought you some level of comfort for yourself here. So, you're solid. I'm seeing that you may be doing something on social media here. At first it didn't work out. And then I'm seeing something became more solid for you. I'm seeing that you looked at a situation before. Like um, you were holding on to something very, very tightly. Um, your happiness. You just wanted to be happy. I'm seeing success. You've been working really hard on your success, being really busy, two of pentacles, and trying to balance things out in your life here. There's someone who you looked at as being somebody who is... some. This is someone very tall. Someone very tall or bulky. Um, Leo Aries Sagittarius, possibly. I'm seeing that you look at this person here in a very high light. Like, they grab your attention. This is someone who you you are very attracted to. Um, somebody who, like, is a go-getter. This is someone very ambitious. You saw this person in a, in a very high light here. A uh, mentor. Some of you have a mentor. Oh. But it feels like you've been juggling a lot and then... Something went wrong in the midst of you trying to balance things out. Relationships, your finances, work. Um, it looks like you have been mourning and grieving a situation and going through some, some emotions and deep feelings here regarding this person, this man. Because I'm seeing it's a man. You wanted to work something out here, but there was a lot that hasn't been said. A lot of confusion and even secrets so right now for some of you you feel like the situation is stuck it's not moving it's not going anywhere um you're you may be feeling stuck or restricted or in your head right now but something is taking off or something's moving very quickly for you regarding your finances here unexpected income suddenly Soon, I'm seeing some sort of unexpected income for yourself here, but it looks like to me you're going through this motion where you're you're needing to take time for yourself, or you're needed to be needing to be alone for a little bit, a little bit, a little while. I'm seeing we have the hermit, which is you going into some reflection, deep introspection mode, thinking, looking for signs about what your next move is. Connecting with spirit, going on to this, this journey for yourself here, spiritual journey. 
you see that there's somebody around you who has a burden. They feel burdened by something that they didn't show up to. Um, I'm seeing you see that they have a big responsibility. They're trying really hard to keep something from falling down. Um, and it's like on the brink of like this person is still not giving up. But it looks like to me, now you're having doubts. Now you're starting to wonder if this is even worth giving your time and energy and investment into anymore. Because I'm seeing the actions you want to take is you really want to stop giving to this situation. Or you want to stop giving money to this person. Um, yeah, you're starting to doubt whether or not you should keep doing this. Meanwhile, they're really trying it's like this is falling, things are falling down and they're still trying to keep this up. But you're, you're like coming to the point where you're giving up. You're done trying with this. You're starting to see signs that it's no longer working or it's no longer worth giving your time and energy into. It's like things are quickly coming to an end. And you're feeling, although you're going through this situation, you're starting to gain the confidence and the energy or the ambition to take action every single day. You're starting to gain that confidence and that in yourself when it comes to a decision of seeing what's at the end of that tunnel in this situation, whether the grass is greener on the other side or not. So, I'm seeing Sagittarius, Leo, Aries here, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. This person is very intuitive. Um, intuition. So, they may be a tarot reader, or psychic, medium. Possibly, they may be at a distance from you, long distance. So, Four of Wands reversed. They feel like things are definitely, there's a breakdown in communication. They feel like it's not going to last. They want to be independent and they want to focus on their success. They see you in a highlight as well, but they see that you're getting ready to close this chapter with them. And you're getting some sort of closure. Yeah. It kind of feels almost, almost like an agreement or mutual where you two are both looking at this situation like yeah we should probably both just move on they they see you um also they're seeing you very far away from them or distant or you've distanced yourself from them but they also see that you're going through some sort of you're entering a cycle of just success for yourself here and it's like you're you've also inspired this person to be more independent and focus on their success and their happiness They, they want to make something right here before before some something comes full circle. Okay. So we have the sun, ace of pentacles. So they want to give you something tangible and make some an investment. This person may owe you money. Or they want to give you some some money. But they're no longer waiting for, like, this situation to... It's like they've given up or they're also on the brink of giving up. Even though they show, like, they're not giving up, I'm seeing that they're pretty much also giving up here. But they still want to have a solid foundation with you or a new start or a new beginning on separate roads. We do have breakup. So it does look like you two are both kind of expecting a breakup here. There is resistance though with that Eight of Cups reverse. Resistance. Someone wanting to break up and then the other person doesn't want to break up anymore. Um, lovers. 
going back. It looks like an on and off again situation here. Someone coming back around, wanting to be in a relationship out of the blue. But you have a new beginning. I see you freeing yourself, honestly. It feels like you, you would be the one to get yourself out. This person... doesn't want to break up but i'm seeing it's like the right thing to do also this is divine intervention here this is the divine getting in the middle of this situation to widen your perspective in order for you to see the light and see this new possibility this new beginning for yourself with this pathway, you're being guided and you're being led towards a new beginning for yourself. I see you freeing yourself from all this stress and anxiety because this situation is only leaving you sleepless, anxious, up at night, triggered. Spirit wants you to be aware of that and pay attention to like your mindset. Especially the type of people that put you in this mindset is not the type of person you want to be with or be in a relationship with. That's why the divine is coming in. But I see you taking a leap of faith here. You're going to take a leap of faith towards um, ending this and having a new beginning. And this may be even very like suddenly... From one second to another, you'll be like, yeah, I'm done. But this person, they're going to, yeah, they're going to try to resist. Like, they're going to want to ask for ask for another chance. There's resistance, definitely. But you're going to, I see you being the one putting an ending. The numbers I'm seeing here is 25, 36, 27, and 35. So let's channel some, some more messages for you all. I think earlier we were talking about a party or a birthday or a celebration because I saw some balloons. Um, someone couldn't show up because there was another... Uh, I'm seeing another... I'm hearing occupation, third party involving an occupation was chosen. It feels like this person is always, um, it's not making you like a priority. And now you're realizing that it's only keeping you stuck. It's only keeping you restrained to this person and this thing here. Last straw feels like it's the last straw. Strawberries. I'm seeing the letter C. Catherine. Trees, a lot of trees. I'm hearing willow tree. Minnie Mouse. So that may uh, be significant for some of you, or that may be a sign that this is your reading. But with that being said, that's what I'm gathering, so what I'm seeing. If it resonated, let me know. Again, if you're interested in a personal reading, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you all. Okay, so I hope you have an amazing rest of your day, guys. Bye.